Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is actually my first video and I decided to make a makeup tutorial basing it off of Valentine's Day since it's right around the corner. I'm so excited. I love Valentine's Day. Oh, it's just so romantic. But anyways, this is my look. I did all... No, wait. I did use mostly drugstore products. Except for my BH Cosmetics, you can order that online. I will leave a link down below in the description box telling you which palette I use. It's really affordable too, so don't think that just because it's not in drugstores, it isn't affordable. But anyways, yep. If you guys want this look, this pinky, grayish, smoky eye look, just keep watching. Okay guys, let's start off. We are going to start off by using the Milani eyeshadow primer and we're going to put a little bit on our finger. Just enough to cover your eyelid and we're going to smudge it. Well for me, I smudge it with my finger. I feel like it works a little bit better than just using a brush. And you're just going to do that all over the eyelid. <laughs> After you do that, you're going to use the color tattoo. The color tattoo in metal by Maybelline New York in the number 70. And it's the barely naked color. And you're going to use your finger as well since it's so creamy. You're just going to rub that all over your eyelid. Oh, you guys, I totally forgot to tell you guys that you guys want a piece of tape on the side of your eyes to have a clean line of makeup so your makeup won't be all over the place. Next, uh, you want to take a grayish color from the BH Cosmetics, any grayish color, and you want to use your smudge brush to put it all over the eyelid, gently on top of your base coat. So just put it all over your eyelid. Now what you're going to want to do is take a hot pink eyeshadow and use your blending eye brush and blend it all up in your crease line. Now what you're going to want to do is take that same blending brush and take a lighter pinky color just to blend it out a little bit more just to tone down that pink color because we do not want to look like no clown. Now you want to take a darker gray, darker than your eyelid, and you're going to want to rub that in your crease with the eye defying brush. And you're going to want to put that in a V shape and on top of your lid. Not to cover the pink though. Make sure you do not cover the pink. You want the pink to show a little bit. Now you want to take a light, that light thing pink color and you're going to go over your crease again just to bring out the pink scent. Now you want to take that same gray light color that we used for the base and we're going to put that all a little bit on top of the, the bottom lid because you want to bring out that little shimmery grayish color. Since you blended so much that color probably faded away and you want to retouch it. Now you're going to take your favorite liquid eyeliner and we're going to wing it out just enough not too thick but not too thin you want it to show but not too much less is more guys less is more now what you're going to want to do is take your favorite eye pencil and you're going to put it on your waterline and after that, we're just going to take off the tape, guys. Take off the tape after you put this on. Now 
we're gonna take a dark gray color and we're gonna smudge it all underneath our eye. Now you're gonna wanna take your favorite mascara and we're gonna put it on our bottom lashes and after that, we're gonna put it on top of your lashes. Ladies, let's make some sexy lashes. Now what you're going to want to do is take a really glittery eyeshadow and you're going to want to put it in the inner corners of your eyes. I'm just going to use the same one I used for my face. Now what you're going to do is take your favorite bronzer. I'm using the Maybelline Dream Sun and you're going to put that inside your cheekbones and you're going to make sure you blend that all out. Now you're going to take your favorite blush, I'm using the Berry Amore in 03 in Milani and you're just going to put that on your cheekbones. Now moving on to lips, we're going to take your chapstick and you're, putting, you're just going to rub it all over your lips and you're going to take a nude lipstick, I'm using the Milani in number 26 nude. And there you guys have it, the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was really fun to make. I'm so excited to be a part of the YouTube community. I mean, you gotta start off from nothing, right? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did enjoy it and you guys want to see more videos or more makeup tutorials or whatever you guys want, I can do this hair tutorial. It was really fast and easy. I can do another makeup tutorial or whatever you guys like. Um, just leave. If you guys have any questions whatsoever, just leave them down below. I will reply. If you guys want another video, just let me know what you guys want to see. And I will do them. I really like doing these videos. I really enjoyed it. I hope you guys did too. So, thank you guys. Deuces.